And while the world mourns the loss of the Queen, people here in the Miami Valley are sharing their memories. A group of students at Carroll High School had a once in a lifetime opportunity to actually see the Queen when they were on a school trip. Two News reporter Riley Phillips spoke with one of the teachers on that trip and shares their story. Riley. Brooke and John, this group of students and teachers was truly in the right place at the right time. They were visiting Windsor Castle back in 2017, and they had no idea they were going to see the Queen and share in her Easter Sunday service. Social studies teacher Chris Sorrell and his group from Carroll High School thought they were stopping to see Windsor Castle before heading to Mass on Easter Sunday 2017. Through a series of unlikely events, uh, accidentally admitted um, through a particular gate because someone believed we were uh, there for the service, whatever that meant. But little did they know they were about to be just several feet from Queen Elizabeth II. Then uh, Bentley pulled forward and the Queen stepped out and went in to her Easter service. The group was able to listen to the Easter service from the lawn of Windsor, praying and singing along with the Queen and her family just on the other side of the chapel. And then at the end of the service, about an hour, we had a wonderful time in the sunshine enjoying the Queen's service. Uh, she came back out. Uh, she waved at us. Um, she, I think she knew there wasn't supposed to be anybody on our lawn that day. Sorrells still can't believe their luck that day, a chance encounter everyone hopes to make when they travel across the pond. Maybe you'll meet the Queen is what people kind of see you off with when you're on the way to London. And, and we were that million to one shot where, yeah, we did see the Queen. As people around the world mourn the death of Queen Elizabeth, Sorrell will hold on to these memories a little tighter. It was a sad day, but she certainly lived a full life and, and we, were, we were lucky enough to have our moment with perhaps the most famous and recognizable person in the 20th century. So cool. And Sorrell says he is grateful to the Queen's security detail and the staff at Windsor Castle for letting his group stay there and see the Queen. And he also remembers being so impressed with how respectful his students were that day since no one knew they would be in the presence of the Queen. In the studio, Riley Phillips, 5 on 2.